Now let's take a look at workspace. So here we've got our two palettes open we're going to be using. I also like to keep my paragraph styles and my character styles, so I use those all the time. And maybe I'll keep my pages palette open because that'll help me get around my document. But all the rest of these palettes I don't really need right now because I'm just going to be doing the task of building table style. So I'm going to close all of these. And I'm going to rearrange these palettes in a way that makes sense so I can see them and they're all easily accessible. And then I'm going to create a workspace. Let's go to Window, Workspace, New Workspace. I'm going to call this one Tables. And there you go. Now I've got a Tables workspace that I can come back to any time and change around if I want to go back to a different workspace, the home one that I usually work in. And if I want to work on some tables, I can switch back to my tables workspace. And here are the palettes as I've arranged them, ready to go.